The following videos are taken from a beta version of the 0.9.920 update. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello there, and today we're going to be going over most of the new features coming to the next update for Simp Rockets 2. This video is going to be split into three parts, so let's start with the first part. New parts added in the new update. First of all, we're going to talk about the RTG. If you don't know what an RTG is, it's a radioisotope electric generator, which uses radioactive decay to produce energy. As you can see here, the model looks really good. And there's three different options you can change with the RTG. First of all, you can hide the base, which obviously, you know, hides the base. And the other two options are to change the RTG's length or its size. Doing this will change how much power it outputs. And remember, RTGs are normally used in places where sunlight isn't strong enough to use solar panels. Next up, we have the generator. The generator uses fuel to produce power, as, you know, all generators do. It can't use all the fuels in the game, but it can use a lot of them. And as you could expect, each fuel has different performance values. There's also a power generation value, which lets you change the maximum power of the generator. You can obviously also make it different sizes, which will change the output as well. You can also change how much sound it makes with the sound slider. The next few parts all pretty much go together. First of all, we have the space habitat. The space habitat is essentially a fuel tank, but instead of holding fuel, it holds druids. Just like with the space capsule, you can change how many druids can go in it by changing the size. And also just like a capsule, you can change the exit rotation and exit position. The space habitat coincides with another part called the crew compartment. The crew compartment is almost identical to the space habitat, except it can hold more people and it has a few different stats, for example it weighing more. And the final quote-unquote part of this trilogy is the tourist. A tourist is essentially a druid that doesn't come with a jetpack or a grappling hook. This is the only change that I can actually find between them and druids, so I think that's all there is. And this is the command disc. In terms of what it does, it's pretty simple. It just combines three existing parts. Those three being the battery, the command chip, and the gyroscope. Although it doesn't add anything new, it's just extremely convenient because it means you don't have to combine all these three things and it also means that you're going to save on a few parts. And the last part is the package. It might be a little difficult for you to find this part, but it's in the all parts menu. The package comes in three different styles, wooden crate, shipping container and barrel. And with that said, that's everything for the parts section. Also this video was entirely edited by Game Knight, so big thanks to him. So thanks for watching and we will see you in the next one.